Hello, Graham, uh, CEO of the Historic Sports Car Club. How long have you been a member of the Historic Sports Car Club? Well, I've been running the club as the chief executive, I suppose, for about um, um, 15, 16, 17 years, actually. I've lost count. <laughs> so you've seen a few changes over the years, then? I have, but I've been, I've been involved in, in uh, organising and running race meetings all my working life, really, because I used to race myself a lot. And then when I stopped, I took over sort of the organising, so I used to work for the British Automobile Racing Club as well. So it's something I'm very familiar with and um, thoroughly enjoy doing. And you've got a new series the club this year, the Jaguar Heritage Series. Is it, have you got many, mem many entrants for that yet? Or? Um, yes, we've got a lot of interest um, because um, it's nice to be working with Jaguar again. We as a club ran the E-Type Challenge <coughs> when uh, the uh, E-Type celebrated its 50 years. And we did that for three years with Jaguar, um, and they approached us again uh, because they had an idea of running a new series, which includes E-types, um, but not solely for E-types. It's for Jaguars that were built and raced prior to 1966. So this time it'll be E-types together with uh, XKs, um, C-types, D-types, and Mark ones and two saloons. So a real mixture, but all with a Jaguar. Uh, badge on the front. So what? Uh, how many races in the series? There'll be five. Um, four in the UK and one on the continent um, as a support race for the um, Nürburgring Old Timer Grand Prix uh, in Germany um, in, uh, in August. But we start with the first race at the Donington Historic Festival, first weekend in May, it's a bank holiday. And then we do a race at Silverstone, the Grand Prix circuit. Uh, we do the Brands Hatch Super Prix on the Grand Prix circuit beginning of July. Uh, then, of course, to the Nürburgring, and then we finish up at um, the Alton Park Gold Cup um, on August Bank Holiday. So, um, yeah, quite a, quite a nice programme. So, what's the, when's the first meeting of the year for the Historic Sports Car Club this year? Our first meeting is actually at Thruxton on Easter weekend, uh, first weekend in April, that is. Um, so um, we're looking forward to that. Entries are all coming coming in already, and um, that starts our pretty busy season, actually. Have you any other new formulas coming through, apart from the, the usual ones, you know, the <coughs> 70 sports, the classic road sports, etc.? Anything new coming through this year? Um, well, the Jaguar Heritage Challenge, which you've mentioned, and then we're actually reforming. We've run a series called the Martini Trophy, which is the sports cars, and we've broadened and uh, widened the eligibility of that to run um, for GT cars and touring cars up to 1979. It's really reforming the World Endurance Championship of those years um, and that's going to bring some cars that haven't raced with us previously. So that's quite exciting. Well, well thank you very much for the interview. Finally got the interview with you <laughs> <laughs> after a number of years of trying uh, and I hope you have a good season again. Thank you very much Thank indeed. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right.